This is Paul Shrimp from PrecisionEgg.com. At the recent Commodity Classic trade show, we got a chance to catch up with renowned consultant and precision ag expert Dr. Harold Reitz about upcoming trends in precision agriculture technology. Specifically, we asked him about growers' attitude about recent consolidation in the marketplace and opportunities that exist for consultants looking forward into the future. Here's Dr. Reitz. Well, I'm sure that some farmers say, well, these guys were independent before, now they're linked with this other company, so that may, may be positive, may be negative, depending on how they like the other company. But uh, from a viability long-term standpoint, it probably makes sense for people to combine their resources and, and work on common interests. And I think most, for the most part, they've been people that have worked closely together before anyway, so it just made more sense to combine and reduce some overhead. There. I think the, the bottom line hopefully will be a positive for the for the technology and the industry both. You get some hot topic areas and we get several companies developing something to fit that niche, but like you say, there are gaps and we need to figure out how to fill those and with the new companies or maybe with mergers of some of these we can, can do that. What are the what are the cool opportunities that you see in, in maybe in this year and the, in the years ahead for, for the Well I guess uh, opportunities come from needs and one of the real critical needs we still have is how do I use the data that I've been collecting what how do I take this information and or take this data and turn it into information and then turn it into decisions that help me to make a better what we call a better informed decision on nutrients on fertilizer or seed placement seed selection all the things that decisions farmers have to make how to use this technology. A lot of farmers have been collecting data now for 10, 15 years, and they've got a gold mine of information, but still not easy to sort it out. It takes a lot of work, takes a lot of time, it takes some data analysis that a lot of farmers, that's not what they're really programmed to do. They're, you know, they didn't become a data analyst for a career, they became a farmer. They want to grow crops and they want to be in that business and down the road I see a growing opportunity for the consultants that can provide that kind of service. Uh, how I, it's been a kind of on the edge of how you make that pay. In order to make a living out of data analysis you have to have more farmers than one person can handle I guess to, is the bottom line. So we got some things to sort out along that way the business model aspect. The need is there, when the need's there, somebody's gonna figure out how to meet it. And that's really what the bottom line is, I think. For PrecisionAg.com, this is Paul Schrempf.